World of Dentistry. Dental Solutions for Your Dental Needs. Dental Crown Procedure. Hello and welcome to our video about the Dental Crown Procedure. In this video, we will discuss what you need to know about dental crowns, from what they are and when they are needed, to the different materials available and the procedure for placing them. What is a dental crown? Let's start with the definition of a dental crown. A dental crown is a protective cover that is placed over a damaged, weakened, or broken tooth to restore its shape, function, and appearance. Dental crowns can be made of different materials, such as ceramic, metal, and resin. When is a dental crown needed? There are several cases in which a dental crown might be needed. Some of these cases include extensive cavities, dental fractures, root canal treatment, worn down teeth, and large fillings. What types of dental crowns exist? There are several types of dental crowns available. Ceramic crowns are known for their natural appearance and ability to mimic the color and texture of natural teeth. Metal crowns are commonly used in molars due to their strength and durability. There are also metal and porcelain crowns that combine the aesthetics of ceramic with the strength of metal. Resin crowns are a more economical option, but they are not as durable and resistant as other options. What is the procedure for placing a dental crown? The procedure for placing a dental crown is performed in two appointments. In the first appointment, the dentist will prepare the tooth by removing any existing cavities or fillings and shaping the tooth to receive the crown. If the tooth is severely damaged, it may be necessary to add additional structure, such as a core or post. Then, an impression of the patient's mouth will be taken and the appropriate color for the crown will be selected. In the second appointment, the crown will be placed on the tooth and the fit and bite will be checked. Fitting and placement of the crown. The dentist will check that the dental crown fits properly and that the shape and color are appropriate before proceeding with its placement. In some cases, additional adjustments may need to be made to the crown before it is permanently placed. Cementing the crown. Once the crown is ready, the dentist will apply dental cement to adhere it to the tooth. The cement will harden over time, ensuring that the crown stays in place. What happens after placing the crown? Follow-up appointments. After the crown is placed, the dentist may schedule follow-up appointments to ensure that the crown is properly fixed and that the patient is adapting well to their new crown. It is important to note that the procedure for placing a dental crown may vary depending on the type of crown used, the condition of the tooth, and the preferences of the dentist. The dentist may provide the patient with specific care instructions for their new dental crown, such as avoiding hard or sticky foods and practicing good oral hygiene. Additionally, it is important to highlight that, although dental crowns can last for many years, they may require replacement in the future due to wear and tear or the development of new cavities. Therefore, it is important to maintain good oral hygiene and schedule regular appointments with the dentist to ensure that both the crown and natural teeth remain in good condition. Conclusion? In summary, dental crowns are an effective solution to restore the appearance and functionality of damaged or weakened teeth. If you need a dental crown, make sure to discuss the different material options with your dentist, and typically it is divided into two appointments. You may require additional adjustments to ensure that the crown fits properly. It is important to follow the dentist's care instructions to ensure the durability and long-term success of the dental crown. That's all for today. We hope this video has been useful to better understand the today's topic. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more information.